This is CNN Breaking News. Good evening. My name is Cadet Heinzen, and you are watching Cadet News Network. We are interrupting this program to talk to you about what is being called a zombie apocalypse. Homeland Security states that these zombies are moving at speeds of 10 miles per hour with physiological capabilities of sustainment without food and water. It has also been reported that these zombies are traveling north due to a magnetic pull. The National Guard has been activated in every single state, and President Donald Trump has made a statement. So evidently, there's something going on in Springfield, Massachusetts. Something about a zombie apocalypse. Not really sure why they need the cadets, but we're being activated. Man, I'm freaking dead. Sorry. Oh. Hey, sorry, take that Stetson off as you walk out the door. Roger, How many cadets do we have in CSIMS? Uh, Mr. Dude? Uh, yes, uh, we have 478. However, uh, 396 have a MyPay account. Well, why don't we just contract them all? Alright, that's fine, but they have to finish their 104 R's and they have to be in the Go Army Ed system like the Bursar wants. It was on my slide, guys. <sighs> <laughs> so we're in the middle of a zombie apocalypse. And, and you want to talk about cadet payment requests and CPRs? Are you kidding me? I'm the dumbest guy in the room and even I can figure this out. Well, wait a minute. What about the blue card assessments? All right, let, let, me, let me give you a hypothetical here. All right, let's say the zombies come up here. All we gotta teach our cat can I just have a round house in the face. That's about it, all right? All right, all right, all right but uh, blue cards. Uh, we're gonna need a bigger blue card. All right, wait a minute. I know for a fact that there's some freaking cats up there who have not read the FM. They haven't even freaking read the FM. We can't talk about contracting right now, all right? Wait, wait, what's a, what's a contract? Maybe, uh, Captain Howard, could you uh, speak to some of your numerous experiences at the NTC about similar experiences? Oh, please Zombie no. Apocalypse? Please no. All right, all right. I'm hearing a lot of good ideas here, but no bottom lines. Whipped up commander's intent here for you. Let's get it done. Up front. Rangers lead the way. Yes. Oh, good morning. What can I do for you? Oh, advance camp. One minute. Just accessing your sessions data. Okay, um... Scroll. You are going to advance camp. Sophia? Yes? How is the sessions data coming? Coming along, just waiting on a few more security clearances from some MS-3s. I don't know! And, uh... Sergeant York, uh, April 1, Sessions data. Um, what? April 1, Sessions data. Um, yep. the, the paperwork. Uh, yep, yes sir, go out, go out. These MS-3s that are studying abroad, they, uh, they keep giving me a lot of trouble. I think I should probably let them know about the zombie apocalypse here. Uh, they should definitely know about that. Let me talk to the colonel, though. PC. Yep, hey, hey April. Yeah, I, I know we gotta move those cadets, I know. Yeah, I, do you have any ideas? Uh, Alright, we'll, all right, we'll, we'll figure it out. Thank you. Hey, uh, sir? Hmm. Uh, we have to move those cadets. Do you, uh, do you have any suggestions? Well, um, hmm. Bravo Company's medevac is all the way at the top of the anchor still. And they're not doing anything. Clearly they don't need it up there. It's not like we have anything outside. So we could probably call uh, Captain Jones and Sergeant Boyle and have them bring it down from the anchor. That, that would definitely make a lot of sense and that would, that would work. I think it's actually in one, of my, in one of my slides here and they said something about it being in an FM somewhere. So that, that would definitely work. Yeah, we should do that, we should do that, yeah. Mr. Dewey? 
Yes, sir, John. Can you get the colonel? On my way. Hey, Mr. Dewey, how are we doing? How are we doing today? Hey, hey. Right. So all, all the cadets are set in, you know, freaking, freaking, uh... Oh, uh, you know I don't like it when you say hey, that. Hey, sorry, but so the uh, 12th reg, we got our 12th reg, 11th reg, you know, the internships, air assault school, all, all that mm -hmm. fun stuff, you know. And, and so anyway, I'm out right there, you know, I gotta go on to camp, but Disneyland. I went to Disneyland, and then yeah, I went to Disneyland. But, but uh, yeah, 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 you know, I think, I think so. I think my son's coming in. But then we, oh, we gotta feed this goldfish stuff. So we're gonna have to think about something like that. Uh, goldfish shit. You know, you know what good people? Goldfish. Yeah, goldfish. You know, something you know, like swimming and stuff. Yeah. So anyway, yeah. Like fluids. Yeah, that's yeah that's and then, then a 12, 12 mile rock. Oh, oh, what is it, Mr. Dewey? Anything for you? I'm gonna need you to help us out. We've got the <laughs> apocalypse, and oh. we're gonna have to fill up these GSA bags. Oh, okay. It's got to be Are they V8s? V8s. 87 octane oh. in the GSA 87. Band. Okay, so that's a 87. 8, 8, 7, not the premium. V8. Now remember, it's this a, V8, is a government right? vehicle. Oh, okay. Military grade <laughs> aluminum. Let's go to the colonel. All right, let's, 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 let's head there. How's it going, mess, sir? Call me Daryl. Hey, sir. Oh, shoot. I don't want to... Gotta go back and feed my ferret. So, so gas, V8 engine, Roger, sir, I'm on it, I'm 80, on it. 87 octane, no spiders in the tank. I go feel my ferret. Sir, can we come in? Oh. Yeah. Uh -oh. Sir, we have a, a question on the zombie apocalypse. We'd like to know if uh, you'd like to transport these cadets via GSA or golf cart. Well, GSA makes more sense. Okay. Is there anything else, Mr. Reed? No, back to your army song and your flutter kicks. Oh. Sergeant Major! You know, I woke up this morning, I told myself it was a good day, it's Friday. And I've been looking around for this darn picture of a tank blowing some stuff up, alright? Mm -hmm. And and it's really, it's it's coming down on me, and I'm about to Arnold. nuke somebody, alright? Because I I had this soldier, and he was in a tank, and we were we were out we were out on a training mission one mm -hmm. time, and uh, he, he his dog just died that morning. I told him, I said it's Friday. And it was Monday, but I told him it was Friday. I was trying to cheer him up. He had that deep down in his his emotional rucksack. Okay, Are everybody, sure everybody has, everybody has their own kind of emotional rucksack. And the trick is when you when you get out and you're about to go on that rug, you just gotta dump all your water. All right, you don't need that. It's just gonna slow you down. You just gotta strap up your emotional rucksack. Sir, I'm pretty sure that's what that's what you're trying to print out. No, it's supposed to be double-sided. You sure about that? Alright, and then and then you just you start going. You start you just gotta you gotta go as hard as you can, right? I'm from the older army. Instead of is that emotional intelligence? That's okay? a great story, Sergeant Major. And maybe this tank is in your mind. Let's go to the uh, HRC department. HRC. I had an HRC department one time.
With and the 21st we had a, infantry? We had, yeah, with the 21st infantry. That, that's right. And I had this HRC department. And we do right. I'm new to the army here. I'm new to the army. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm just a lonely old, you know, second lieutenant. But uh, I know we should be game planning for what's going on. I'm not talking about CPRs and, and blue cards and whatever else he was talking about. Man. They sure uh, created what? this meme, aka visual aid, about what. What do you got? What do you got? About what we got not. We got, we got, we got about what to? not to look like during uh, uh, a zombie got? apocalypse. <laughs> Poopy face. What the? What do you? The department and uh, his dog died too. A lot of dogs. Hey, sir. What's up? You want to mess with Eric today? Yeah, what do you got? I don't know. I heard through the grapevine that uh, he forgot to uh, wish his wife happy birthday on her own birthday. Are you serious? I'm dead serious. Freaking idiot. What an idiot. You know what? I got an idea. I'm going I'm I'm to make, make a meme with it. Make him make a meme with him. Meme king right there. That's the meme king. Check it out. I got the show. There's stuff going on. I'm trying I'm trying to help you. I don't ruck. Uh, oh, oh, oh. Why don't you ruck? I typed. We you're typing. We didn't we didn't do what nah. What are, what are you doing there, Captain Howard? Yep, sir. Oh, sir, sir. Sir? Sir, you call me sir, Captain Howard? I am a sergeant, mate! I'm, I'm sorry, I shouldn't be nuking people. Emotional, inte emotional intelligence, I'm, I'm sorry. Wait, why'd you, why'd you need me here, Mr. Dewey? Sergeant York? So, so, uh, Sergeant Major, one thing that we're trying to do is we have to transport all of these cadets. And, uh, Captain Howard had a, had a good idea. Had a good idea. What was that again, sir? Uh, so, I believe... Bravo Company has their medevac plan for up at the anchor, but they don't really need it up there, so we could just we could just use their their van, bring it down here. We don't have anything outside, so clearly that that would work. I'll put that in a slide though. Probably go on that, sir. Actually, uh, the colonel wants to use golf carts. How y'all doing? Uh, Good morning, sir. sir. How, 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 how are you, sir? How are you? As you were, sir. Yeah, thank you, sir. Yeah. Uh, here we had a couple golf carts. Yep, right out there is a uh, National Guard one. It's more than two people. That's good. Yeah, what a song it is! You're a useless captain. You know, that's, come on, man. I just don't understand how I got stuck with you in the Miss One part. I really don't. I really don't understand how I got stuck with you. I, right, yeah, let's go. Let's go. I still don't understand. Go to the service center. The service center. Where's the service center at? Do you know exactly where it is, sir? No, I really don't, actually. I'm not from around here. So I want to go back to Texas. Hey, hey, sorry, what were those 104Rs? You don't know if you have... I did not do 104Rs. I don't even know. I can't even hold them. That's all for Captain Howard. Oh, my God. God. <laughs> Excuse us, sir. Gear up for war. Fire it up! Roger that, Colonel. Alright, Sergeant Major, let's uh, inspect this year uh, medevac vehicle? I thought that we were going to use Bravo companies. Yeah, when I was a uh, private in the Army, we didn't even have medevac vehicles. We had a uh, uh, what was it? We had a horse, and that horse, it, it, it was a good horse, and it I used mean, to it used yeah. to carry everybody, that, that everybody down from, from the mountains and everything. Mm -hmm. right, and so you're gonna turn this uh, sure this here golf going. pedal of a golf cart first time. It went it went flying all over. Oh, oh, sir, are you okay? Uh, see, uh, sir, well, sir. Here's 
the thing. Right. See, I drive, so, I drive a caramel toffee-colored monster truck with teeth, and this is nothing like that. Uh, so I'm just really not used right. to this. I, well, I remember the first time I drove monster truck, and uh, it, it, it was a good time. All right, all right, sir. So we're gonna we're gonna park now. All right? Okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna right. just I'm just gonna turn that off there, sir. All right. I'm, I'm sure we're, we're gonna go. Up, we're gonna tell uh, Colonel that everything's going all right. Oh, oh shit. Sir. 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 Oh. What is it? Good morning. I told him, I said, when you get on, you got to take the, the first three steps, and then you, you just got to make sure you keep walking from there, one foot after another. That's what we always did back when I was a kid. So, uh, Sergeant Major, what do we got going on over here? Uh, you see, we were testing out that golf cart there, making sure it all run right and everything. And he got off golf cart and he, and he took three steps. And he didn't listen to my advice. He just he just kept stepping on and he slipped and he he fell there, sir. And he failed. All right. Well, uh, I'll call uh, Sergeant York. Tell him to uh, close station march over here. All right. All right. So, sounds very good, sir. That's a good idea, sir. Help get Captain Howard back into the wheelchair. Right. I had a wheelchair once. And it was, it was not a fun time. It was probably... Uh, CPRs! Okay, brother. All right, all right, all right. Sure, sure, hey, sure, calm sure. down there, sir. Sure. Oh, all right, okay. Okay. Oh, oh, my right. tailbone! You got him, sorry. You're on uh, What am I? Oh, oh sorry, my tailbone. Oh, God. Hey, sorry, mate. Can I run him down the hallway? Oh, oh, no, you cannot run him down the hallway! I did not tell you! You run the cat down the hallway! I'm, I'm sorry. Emotion, emotional intelligence. I should not have nuked you like that. I'm sorry. No, you can't be. Rolling the captain down the hallway as fast as you can. Just, just bring him in there. I'll, I'll even open the door for you. Right, sir. You. Rodriguez, get in here! Oh, jeez. You, you got the van keys I've been waiting for? Van? Oh, yes. yeah. Cam, yeah. Cam Joe's got those. Yeah. Might, might take a couple rounds. Do a lot of size too. Zombie you know, pop. There's been a zombie pop outbreak. It's from Massachusetts. All right, we're good. Yes, Cam Joe's. You get the gas. Premium VA system. Just get the gas. Get the gas. Get the gas. Get the gas. Yeah. Get the gas. yeah. Uh, uh, we'll do good. Jeez. I, yeah, I went all the way from Barry through my spare. You know. All right. Uh, keys, keys are good. All right. Let's. Uh, I'm gonna take a seat. So. Good afternoon. You're, you're supposed to greet me first. I'm a female. Well, uh, I've been a major longer than you have. Yeah, well, I went to West Point, okay? I don't see your West Point ring. Alright, sorry. Uh, Let's try it again. Go back. All right. Try it again. Yes, yes, ma'am. Good afternoon, ma'am. Good afternoon, sir. Oh. Mr. Burns. Oh, hi, hi. Hi. Now, uh, what do we got going on over here? Oh, what, what, uh, what do you think we, we got going on here? Which... What, what do I, what do I think? I, I why are you here? A, uh, cadet came to me with a question today. Uh, I figured you could, could have some, uh, insight on that. Uh, who is General Milley? Chief South in the Army. Who is Chief uh, South in the Army? <laughs> Jeopardy, really. <laughs> right. Right. Um. Oh, you got another through, question? Oh, I got another question. Oh, all right, all right. Who through, uh, Leaders Eat Last? Uh, I think I got some ideas for, uh, Apocalypse in here. I tagged a few. All right. I'm gonna take all right. a look. Um, I got some. Uh, I got some good content in here. Huh? So. Uh, that looks like a book. Yeah. Yeah. yeah some good ideas in here. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You say so. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Yeah. All right well. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna close station march out of here. Okay, uh, yeah. You take these, Mr. Burns. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Keep up. Keep it up. the cadets are being eaten by zombies, they have no opportunity to really eat last, so to speak. Now, in this case, who becomes the leader? The cadets? The zombies? Well, I guess as they say in the book, as the Zen Buddhist saying goes, how you do anything is how you do everything. Hey, how you doing, Mr. Burns? Oh, hi, hi. Oh, zombie apocalypse, yeah, what, do you, uh, what do you think about that? Yeah, oh, yeah, it's, uh, 
It's really something, huh? <laughs> yeah, no, yeah. it definitely is. Yeah, yeah well, that's all right, yeah. Pretty crazy, yeah. Cool. Yeah. Great. Thanks for stopping by, yeah. Anything hey, else we can... Hey, am uh, I interrupting anything? Oh, no, no, come on in. All right, sweet. Oh, hey, so, uh, sir, ma'am, I got this uh, chili cup going on this weekend. And oh, uh, you guys like chili, right? Who doesn't like chili? Oh, yeah. Chili's Absolutely. great. Absolutely. Chili's, yeah. chili's the best. On rice or on beans? On both. That's the way I like it. Yeah, so, yeah, definitely. So, yeah. uh, I'm going to need you guys to... Uh, there won't be any zombies there, right? No zombies. Well, there might be, but basically okay. what I need you guys to do is vote for mine as the best. Simple as that. Okay, yeah, simple as that. Yeah. Uh, I'm in this competition, and... I need to win this shit. Not too easy, I guess. Sound good? Better make good chili, at least. Oh, it's good. The best. The best. All right. Thanks. This chili's probably shit. Hey, sir. Sorry. Take a seat. Thank you, sir. So, uh, as you probably know, I'm going to be uh, in a chili competition this weekend. Chili? Yep, for the Italian, you know. And uh, for what? I was hoping to uh, beat Sergeant Major. I really got to beat him. I need to beat him. So I was wondering if uh, you'd be uh, just uh, willing to, you know, just vote for mine when it when it comes voting time. All right. Let me, uh, Sergeant, you got the time. Let me tell you a story about, about critiquing people. On their work. All right. My daughter, she's in the second grade, mm -hmm. right? And they make her do drawings and paintings and all sorts of artwork. Yeah, I got a daughter too. Great. Well, mine brings in a drawing and she comes home in tears and she tells me, she tells me the teacher told her that her drawing was shit. She, t she told me that. Now, what am I supposed to do about that? I don't know. I don't know. That's so messed up, sir. I would I would email the teacher. So what do you think your chili deserves? Five out of five on every category. <laughs> All right. Okay. Yeah, take it easy. Have a good one. Hey, man. Uh Hello, oh, sorry. What, what, what can I do for you? I'm a little busy. Well, uh, you know we got this chili competition going on this weekend, right? Yeah, that's not really a great time. I, I got a little bit of work to do. Don't don't worry. It, it'll take just two seconds. Okay. Well. Okay. Fine. All right. So we're having the chili competition in the battalion. Are you listening? Yeah. Yes, I'm listening. Okay. So you know we got the chili competition for the battalion, right? Yes, I, I know. I'm going to be making the best one, right? Yeah. Sure. So you're voting five on it. Yeah, I guess so. On all categories. Yeah, yeah, all, yeah sure. I really need you. To I'm not eating your f***ing chili, okay? Roger so that. let me work. Roger that. Thank you. <laughs> so you will not believe what just happened. What happened, our son? Well, I'm crushing the names of cadets here. Look at this. Another one ran over the tank. Bum 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 bum. What happened? XO just blew up on me. Why would you do? Campaign in my chili. Speaking of, so uh, got this chili competition this weekend, as you know. Dude, you don't know. You know I don't eat that shit. Yeah, well, I can't see the ingredients. Come on, you know that? I know it's not what you eat, but I really need you to just. Hey, you doing, Sergeant Major? Hey, hey, cadet, uh, get off the table. Yeah, well, yes, all right, Sergeant. all right. Wait, what are you down here for, cadet? Uh, I was asking Mass Sergeant Treadwell about uh, advanced camp. Sorry, Major. Uh, Daryl. Daryl. Alright, well, let me tell you something. When you go down to advance camp, it, 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 it's not going to matter. You're going to be down in foxhole. Alright? We're, we're evacuating you guys. And you're going to be in that foxhole, and the zombies are going to be coming after you. You can't you can't waver at those zombies. Alright? you got to be eyes of steel. Alright? So you just go, bang! Right? Because then when you're going to go to advance camp, nothing get down there. You're going to be bigger and better and badder than everybody else down there. Alright? Okay? You just... You just got a professionalism, all right? You got to be professional. You got to look at the zombie. You got to say, I'm sorry. Yes, I'm in. All right. Yeah. So, Major, good to see you. What's going on here, Master? Oh, just uh, finishing up my paperwork to retire. Hey. It's my Daryl. 
I've been a command sergeant major for 15 years. All right, I've been in the army for 35 years. All right, why are you getting ready to retire? I'm not getting ready to retire. I still got, I still got a few more years left in me in the army. Oh, why are you getting ready to retire? Let's say I got a thriving photography business, uh, sergeant major. Let's say it's my true passion. It's right. photography. All right, then, Master Sergeant. Hey, you're all messed up here. Okay, that's having a mind for the guard. We're trying to prepare for a zombie apocalypse. They're sitting there, don't understand. It means disenrollment. That's it. Can't believe they have their minds in the gutter like that. Wasn't like that in the old army. My army, army I came in. Army I came in, you didn't even need an alarm clock. In the morning, you know what would wake you up? Passion is what would wake you up. Zombie apocalypse here. We'll just deal it down and around. Books upside down. Starts with the little thing. Have you been looking at these stocks? They're all going down. It's like there's a zombie apocalypse going on. Oh, I should answer this. Help? Oh, hey, sir. Yep. Yeah. Yes, sir. Sure thing, sir. Hey, uh, Sergeant Gomez. Captain uh, Draker wants us to go down to the uh, service center to get ammo. It's freaking crooked, man. Sorry, I'm gonna take that Stetson off when you're inside. Right, Sergeant. So you're going like this, excuse me. You take your beret, you gotta, you gotta just rub it. You just gotta rub it, rub it, pull it down, rub it, and you dip it in the water, get out all the fuzzy wuzzies. I call them fuzzy wuzzies. You gotta get them all that there. You hear, we had a the soldier. down, it must be because they're spying on us or something. They're spying on who? We had a soldier put premium gas in a government asset, okay? You don't put premium gas in a government asset. The Army pays for 87 regular, okay? I just had to nuke this soldier, and I feel bad about it, but I just had to nuke this soldier about putting premium gas inside a government asset. From now on, when you guys go down... Google's down too. Put in Google. What's a Google? Google. Oh my god. They freaking suck, man. I can't take it much longer, I'm telling you. They're talking about Pokemon, the stocks, premium gasoline. Hang out with tankers sometime. I don't know how I got stuck in that office. I really don't. Hang out. Tankers know. Tankers know what's up. Sorry, Major won't let me wear my Stetsons. Mind if I get some reps in, Sorry. Good. <laughs> Alright, you, you wanna try some? Yeah, you've got two. Why don't you demonstrate? Alright, hey, you're gonna go down. Yeah, that's fine. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, that's a thruster. Okay. It's a good move. I do it with my son all the time at the gym. You should come to the gym with me sometime. I'm gonna teach you like my son. You wanna give a shot? I'll give it a while. Alright. I'll keep it up here for you. Okay.
All right, now you're just gonna. Yep. You go down. All right. Yeah. And right up. Press. Oh yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. Man. You get rid of that gut. <laughs> the butte. One more. One more. Yep. There you go. There you go. Push. Oh, there you go. Sorry. Man. All right. Yeah. Feeling better already. Hell yeah. I'll go deal with these idiots. Somebody put gym. and somebody put uh, regular gasoline in this tank. When you put regular gasoline in a tank, you know what happens? This you have to well. every Throw 24 down. hours. John Burns, Mr. John Burns. I think you got the wrong number. Sorry. Hello. Hi, uh, is uh, this North University? This is John Burns. Sir, we're all count for, except for uh, Captain Power, Mass Sergeant Treadwell, and uh, Mass Sergeant High. Hey, Sergeant Team, follow me. All right, all right. I gotta show you something, all right? Last thing we gotta do before we retire. Now, you better not be telling no sirs. All right. That's the enlisted corps. Pull the army up. Sometimes you gotta get your hands a little dirty and roll up the sleeves, right? Know what I'm saying? Ooh. Now that is one cool cat. Oh yeah. Remember, no sirs know about this. Right. Let's go. I'll tell you, man. These freaking zombies better not make you freaking angry. Uh, battle Drill 1 Alpha, right, Sergeant? I'm the barber. I'm Oh, hey, right there. Come on, I got you covered. Let's 
Captain Howard. Uh, we got a uh, hip hammer request the uh, study abroad. Study abroad people need to get their classes all figured out. Oh, come on. Uh, 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 maybe another time. And uh, yeah, th that, is, that is all I have to say about that. All right. Thank you. Are there any questions? <laughs>